lights, camera, green screen? Action. What's up, YouTube? Tyler with Content Evolved, and today we're going to go over how to add a chroma key in Streamlabs. This is going to help eliminate your green screen behind you. You can either add a picture or an animation. Uh, and in a lot of cases, what a lot of streamers do is do that floating body effect, which is what I actually prefer. Uh, that way I don't have to spice up my room too much. I don't have to add all the LEDs and stuff, which eventually I want to. Uh, but for a cheap $25, I built a green screen just to kind of hide the mess and makes life easy. So let's go ahead and go to our video capture device, right click it, go to filters. And as you can see, here I am, green screen behind me. And if you want a video made over how to make the green screen for about 25 bucks, uh, go ahead and comment in the comment section, let me know and I'll get one made. Um, so what we'll do is we'll hit the plus sign right here, scroll down to the chroma key, hit done and voila. So we're gonna have to tweak it a little bit. Um, in my case, I have two different, uh, I guess, tints of green behind me. So it's kind of a pain. Uh, I would recommend getting one, it makes life a lot easier. I was just being stubborn and wanted to rush things. So I'm gonna get this fine tune here. I wanna put this there. Negative seven, and I think 24 should. And as you can see, the green screen behind me is gone now. It's kind of, you can kind of see it's a little, still a little fuzzy. Like I said, I should have gotten one tone of green behind me. But I didn't. I still need to do that. Uh, I'll probably do that this weekend. But make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And let us know what other videos you would like to learn about. See you later.